Hey, I hope everyone's doing all right today. So, uh, the time has come to take these guys out of their containers. Well, most of them. See, he's still coming up right there, coming up. But these tall guys, we're going to plant them. And those buckets right there, you son, what's this dirt? Professional. Look at that. No, I'm just playing, y'all. But yeah, I am going to be using this, so. I'm gonna come back when they're fit. Okay, real quick, I'm down to my last bag, and I just want to tell you, see, I got two pots in here. These are just those, uh, regular old soap. Nothing fancy. Fill them to the max. Haven't loved it. It's damp already. But uh, I'm just excited because I've already done one. You can see that's the that's the seed. Oh yeah, from here on out, I'm not gonna probably gonna take. I don't know. I'm do. 15 of these. We had a container. Flip them. Oh, look at that tap root. It was ready. Woo! Alright, that was embarrassing. Come on, Virginia. Baby girl, you puppy. Yeah, we're just gonna let that sit like that. You use the uh, the cone itself. Take it, jab it in, take it out, and jab it in again. Then flip it. See the reason why it falls apart, there's mulch in there too. I'll use mulch at the very bottom. Here, I'll... See that mulch? You see that root? That way, uh, Jackfruit trees are 
ready to be potted up. This is a month ago from the seeds that my wife had germinated. Showed y'all that one too. Let me go ahead. And... So you leave it all fluffed and everything. So I do it for the trees, even though I'm shaking the mess out of it. Oop, sorry, girl. There we go. Cause it's all gonna settle, you know. I just want to be sensitive. Well, I say sensitive with the tap root, but uh, yeah, you you don't want stiff dirt. You want it to be able to move around your root. Oop, that one ain't it's so bad. But this is the advantage of of using one of these containers instead of one of these pots, because I'd have to use all this dirt. Instead, I use just a little bit of dirt to make sure they live. Got that good root system. These are trees now. They they're not gonna die. Let me. Up. But uh, yeah. I mean, I can't. There we go. Yeah, yeah. Y'all can see better now. All right, yeah. Down the chute she goes. Bring, it up, bring that dirt up around that root. All of this is going to settle into this pot. I didn't shake it or nothing. It's, it's perfect. Do it all loose and it, it will settle down. You see this pot, like this area right here, it actually sink down right here. Everything settled down real good. Just a. Uh, Another one right here. One, two, three, four, five, six. This is number seven. Woo. I'm gonna try squeezing it some. There we go. Yeah, that did a lot better. There goes the roots on that one. Yeah, we're gonna start selling. We're actually up potting this one and using that dirt because uh, we're going to be selling these with old jackfruit seed. Uh, if y'all watch uh, Pete Canaris, he uh, had a jackfruit produce fruit in his uh, greenhouse. He's down South Florida, Central Florida, really. But, uh, that one's small, but look at that. It's gonna give it time and it's gonna be well established in here. But he had fruit growing within uh 18 months from seed. And we got some other jackfruit that's been there for a, a year now. Those were uh I'll show y'all those another time. Right now this is all about planting the jackfruit from the containers. Let me squeeze that before I shake them up. See that root? There you go. You just want it to fall into the hole. You mount that dirt around his neck. And get it tight. Not tight, really. Nice and firm so that way when you do go to water it, it collapses more into it and uh oh this is this is beautiful stuff here because uh yeah my wife started these seeds man I'm so proud of her so 
this one with some leaves on it. That's the seed looking like a peanut up there. That's the seed is split open in half. Let's see. Now I think this is how they do those bare root. they gotta they can ship it bare root and stuff so you wrap the bag around it but I really want to open that up for y'all so y'all can see that seed had cracked open and this is a jackfruit tree you know what I mean? it's like my snake man it's got that long end Yeah, you, just, you want it, the dirt collapsed to it. You don't want to push it in the dirt. You want the dirt collapsed to your root. <clears throat> but yeah, one of these days, y'all, I'm, I'm going to do this stuff. Do this stuff like a... I don't know. This is just pretty cool. Yeah, we uh, started a nursery, Rivera Family Nursery. My wife did. We got inspected. <laughs> we got inspected by the state, you know, Department of Agriculture. They uh, sent two people actually. They loved the yard, everything. It was during the winter too, so it was it was all dead looking, but they could see everything pretty much how we were doing. Yeah, but we passed, got the business license. We got fruit trees growing. Ooh. Um, got a lot of things growing over here. Trying to grow loofah this year. Um, loofah, we got a soap aloe. So you just cut off a piece of this aloe. And uh, rub it together, it lathers up. It's, it's literally soap. It's the aloe that has a red tint to it. I don't know if I showed y'all on the side of the house. Ooh. There. Sorry. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Again, thank you, Jesus, for these seeds doing so good, man. So cool. Yeah, I'm gonna set these out in the front yard. Let them start growing. These. They get them like this, this size. They're 25, but let, let them get that brown wood on them. We got a couple of them. Um, got the hardwood on it. Uh. Those are 40, just because, uh, I mean, it's good hard wood. It's grown. These are still just little babies, but y'all seen the whole journey right here. And that's the cool thing about the YouTube, because uh, from start to, hey, look at the update. Or, hey, look, they all started growing, too. Well, I got a little forest of jackfruit trees. Look at that. Um, there we go. I didn't think I was going to do all of these, but hey, time to start some more trees. He's doing so well. Now, I I'm going to tell you all the truth. I do put mulch on top. 
of the pot on top of the dirt. And I got a reason. Reason being is uh to keep help keep it from drying out, from just being out instead of just the sun hitting your dirt, you know, and heating up the dirt, it's gonna hit that moat and retain some moisture in there. Y'all, y'all go digging some moats, man, and see see how much water is actually in that guy. See how dry he's been. Oh, I don't know. Three months. Go digging that mulch pile. You're like, man, I should have put the garden in this. Yeah. Well, at least down in Florida where it's all sugar sand. And you run your sprinkler system 10 minutes, man. That's it. Anything more than that, it's just going straight through that sand. Bye bye, water. Now this one's pretty cool right here. This is that long gone that I did with a... See, it's starting to grow a second one. This one right here. There we go. A second shoot. The, uh... What did I do with this? Carambola that I did it with this one. It was, uh... Jackfruit, long gone carambola uh, planting or seed seedlings um that was a video but uh that one i put in the pot outside like i said uh when i put it in the container i did it at the wrong time it was already mature enough to go ahead and go in the pot and uh it, it didn't like the container so see if we can revive emt that tree man Tell somebody. All right, I got three more. I'm gonna go ahead and do them. And that's all the dirt that I got. This dirt's gonna feed them too for a while. And if they were mine, I'd be putting fish motion on them. Well, not fish motion. Oh yeah, that's the only way I know how to fertilize. Is with fish, cause uh. Like my wife said, I don't know how to read. Nah, I just, I can't take the time to read it. I mean, I listened to, uh, uh, who, who's that? The VA Gardener. I listened to his song three, four times. Commented, told him, hey, I, 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 I can't seem to hear the name of your <laughs> tree. Then listen to it three times. He done told me, and then I listened to it again. And I heard it, but then I missed it again. At the same time, I was like, all right, well, where was Juju be this time? Uh, you just gotta slow down, pay more attention. Oop. How you doing? Look at that little guy. All these trees, they get a home. They can stretch their legs and be in their zone. All these trees. My oldies tree. I forgot I was recording, y'all. My bad. This is the last one, though. I don't know. YouTube do that thing where y'all don't see that last part. I don't, I don't know. Man. No, I'm just playing. I finished these. I'm going to go inside and play with the babies. Well, it might be asleep. Oh, no, 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 no. Look, see how done crooked it is. Uh oh. Oh, y'all can't. Y'all blurry. So, we still, we, we planted, hold on, <clears throat> hey everyone, so alright, we have 22 trees, jackfruit trees, we just planted in these bigger pots, which they should grow up in those pots, pretty tall, four foot, real good, and uh, we still got 20 more jackfruit to plant, and a long gone from that one video. These guys, I'm going to go ahead and sell them because I need more room, too. And, uh, yeah, we just want to let the first sales of our nursery be jackfruit. 
I don't know. It's a dream. Y'all just gotta start doing y'all's. No. And have some faith, cause <clears throat> yeah, it might get bumpy, but it's all good. You'll make it through the end. You have a good night. Thank y'all for watching.